we added some wooden beams on the side walls and then we refurbished some used walkboards. We resized them and changed the play wood. Platform, so we can fiberglass the whole thing in. Is that okay? Yeah. Can you stand under the roof? I mean, look at that height under. Touch it with your hand. We had a wooden beams fiberglass before we could put back on the refurbished uh, walk boards. Here you can see the cockpit floor, like before and after it was fiberglass. And then it was time to cut off the cockpit roof. Unfortunately, we were not able to film when we took the roof down, but that is a massive, super heavy roof. Uh, so that was kind of like a challenge. And then we realized that the cockpit was kind of small. So we added more space by extending a seating outside of the original structure. Then we were trimming the edges. Price factor of things or you know settings yeah. or whatever like the way things look is not necessarily the way things uh, are inside. Yeah. So it's like oh you know it is like a little raggedy art project or a little bit looking okay outside of course it's massive and it's like grand but then when you step in then it's like oh. a world of peace and. Yeah. You know that's what i'm thinking though and i'm also thinking like in terms of hours you know in the work if i had unlimited of time you know i would have it super nice and stuff but the thing is that we have to prioritize 
where do the hours go you know yeah yeah and that would be like also something that can come up with the time it's not like something you could do while you're laying on an anchor somewhere yeah you know i just want to get out of here and as soon as we kind of you know the paint job have nothing to do with if you can say it or not no mm -hmm.